Thank you. And you? Where do you live? Uh, in San Francisco. Where do you work? Well, I work there too, or at least I used to, if I don't get back Where in time. Where is the post office? The what? The post office. I think I saw one back by Air Fiji. Do you have any bananas? I beg your pardon? I like your blue dress. Excuse me. Responsibility and dependability. These are the cornerstones of any truly modern and competitive institution. Trust and dedication combined with constant imagination, futuristic vision, and creativity have made Riley, Riley, and Associates a leader in 20th century architecture. Meeting adjourned, gentlemen. You're late again, Miles. Listen, pal. I'm telling you this is a friend. I feel sorry for you. I mean, three times this week already. Frank, I had to go to L.A. for my earthquake research. Right on the L.A., huh? How are the beaches? Oh, milk. Yes, Mr. Rod. Oh, look at him. But it's, a uh, mild, sir. Milk, yes. Your behavior lately has been less than professional. You see, I went out of town this weekend to do some research on a special brick I'm developing. It's earthquake-proof. That's all fine and good, Harding. Yeah. There is nothing I like better than initiative, except for punctuality. For the lack of that stone... It's a brick, sir. ...the building would fall. Now, let's get to work. The day is just beginning. Miles, I know we work in a competitive institution, so I shouldn't tell you this. But take my advice and get yourself one of these. What is it? A computer. A 12-month planner organizer. Looks like a candy bar to me. <laughs> well, it's a little one, just for starters. I don't think so. Get with it, buddy. You should see the big one Riley's got in the basement. It could help you with your brick. I'll figure it out by myself, thank you. Tells you the time anywhere in the world. I never go anywhere. Plots your biorhythm. I don't believe in them. And plays happy birthday on your birthday. Okay, hand it over. Now I've got to have one. I'd probably just lose it. Well, just trying to protect you from Mr. Riley. <laughs> that old relic. Shh. Don't say I didn't try. Hey, wait. Can I help you? Um, yes. Well, maybe. I'm looking for one of those things that helps keep you organized. It's the sort of thing that tells you when you have to be somewhere. Oh, the Casio Day Planner. Right. We're out of them. What oh. do you want a toy like that for anyway? Well, a friend of mine told me about it, and uh, sometimes I'm not too organized. Listen, show your friends a thing or two and stay one step ahead of obsolescence. I read that in a brochure. Oh. You want computer components. You know, like stereo equipment? Then you just update the part that gets outdated. What's your preference? Apple, pear, 
Wang. Oh, listen, I don't know anything about computers. Nobody does. But don't you want one for when you do find out? Well, uh, really, all I need is something to keep me on time. Um... Well, look, this will do that. Oh, it will? For sure. And that's just for starters. It's a new model. It can play chess, regulate your heating, balance your checkbook, wake you up in the AM, lock your doors at night, three-color video, four-tone speakers, guaranteed. And I'll give it to you at cost. eyes on me. I'll kill him. I'll kill him. That's it. Tomorrow you go back. What the? Heck? Hello. Hello. You must be my new neighbor. You moving in? Uh-huh. It's nice to meet you. My name's Madeline oh, Lovestaff. Me, oh, me too. <laughs> Is more than one of us? Uh, no, I'm Harding. Uh, Miles Harding. Um, I meant it's nice to meet you. Hey, Miss Roberstadt. Where do you want the high five? Gotta go. Beacon Brothers beckon. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, me too. Um, you can I'm put late. it in the front room. Okay. Oh, damn, I'm late. Well, hurry then. Bye. Hey, lady, where do you oh, want this? Oh, please. That one I'll handle oh, myself. Oh, no. Oh, yes, and I won't even charge you for it. Hey, that's... 
That's so big. Guitar. That ain't no guitar. It's a cello. Is that how you play it? That's how I talk to it. It okay? It okay. That's a nice looking instrument. Thanks. Had it long since I was 12. You've taken good care of it. Oh, my name is Millie. And this is Ruth. Hi, I'm Madeline. Oh, uh, that's Bill. Hello. Hi. How are you? Nervous. Let's begin with something simple. Shall we say uh, Tchaikovsky? First click, huh? Let's see why this doesn't fall apart. Ah! to the cello tune, and let's just listen to our newest member, Madeline Robichaud. Ready? Three more bars and I would have been on the floor. I don't think so. What are you doing later? A diminished seventh with a minor key change. I mean later, like later. Chetty! I thought you'd like to meet a friend. Or at least my boss's computer. It's for you. Hope it feels all right. What was Riley's password? Some fairy tale. Snow White? Beer. Ugly Duckling, Little Red Riding Hood, Jack of the Beanstalk, Rasputin, Rapunzel, Rumpelstiltskin. Rumpelstiltskin. Memory size, unlimited. <laughs> Everything. Tiger, that one. Thank God I work nights.
I just wanted to say that, well, that was wonderful. Hello? Can you hear me? Hello? Well, don't be shy. That was just beautiful. Hmm. Very smart, but weird. Thank you. Attention all shoppers. This booth tour is announced today Friday on Zoom. Oh! Oh, God, I'm sorry. It's I'm all sorry. my fault. I didn't mean... Oh, it's you. Yeah, it's me. I didn't hurt you, did I? No, I'm all right. Here, why don't you just keep your packages with mine? I think most of them are already there. Oh, I wanted to tell you how much I enjoyed your music yesterday morning. Ellie, the music? I wasn't even at the... Wait a minute. What did it sound like? Ginger Snap? I'm so pretty. At first, I thought it was the television. From my apartment? Uh-huh. Must have been... Uh... Not. What? Oh, I'll get them. Oh. Thanks. Sure. So you're a musician? No, I'm an architect. That's what I heard. That's like your music. I think that's the cash register. Really? So what are you doing for dinner, Mr. Archaeologist? Architect. So what made you decide to be a musician? My mother. She used to play a lot of music around the house. Bach, Beethoven, Bing Crosby. And you studied the cello? No, I danced alone in my room, in front of a mirror. I wanted to be a great ballerina. But my mother said I was too short. So she gave me cello lessons instead. So what about you? What, architecture? Well... It's not too exciting right now. It's mostly sinks and bathtubs. Huh? 
the plumbing and high rises. That's what you do the first few years. But I have a special project on the side. Some new building? Mm -mm, some new brick. It's, it has facets, like a diamond. Or, or more, like a jigsaw puzzle. But why? Well, then it won't come apart in an earthquake. And you built this? Yeah. Well, no. But I will, someday. But tell me about your music. My what? Your music, what I heard the other day. Oh, that's, uh, I told you, that's nothing. What are you talking about? It was brilliant. It was? <clears throat> Extraordinary, like we were talking, communicating. Where did you study? Uh, the Pasadena School of Design. Your music? No, architecture. Okay, I'm sorry. For what? For intruding. I understand, I used to dance in my room, remember? That's why I wanted to meet you. I thought you wanted me to hear. But I didn't do it. Well, maybe I did. Just a little. Will I see you again? I think so. We're neighbors. No, I mean out. Okay, when? How about tomorrow night? Well, I rehearse every night this week except Wednesday. Well, Wednesday. And that night I'm going out with some girls in my section. All right. Some other night. Sure. Well. Good night. What's that? Oh, it's nothing. It's um the door. It's um automatic. <laughs> One of those gizmos. I'll stick to keys. <laughs> right. Oh, but Miles, even though you say you don't play, well, I still loved it. And I don't mind if you do it again. Good night. Good night. She said she heard music. Maybe the blender. Couldn't do that. How much is that fourteen hundred dollar computer? Thirty nine hundred. No, Max. That the fourteen hundred is forty eight hundred. The Not the TV. Is 3, I thought the eleven hundred was. Well, at least that works. The complete fifteen ninety five computer that's. Do re mi. Da 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 da. What is going on? How did a dog get in there? Anybody home? Oh, 
were you in the shower? No. Why? Um, well, I, I heard singing. Oh, it's just the radio. Oh, classical? Uh, all the time. So, where is it? What? Where's what? Your instrument. Oh, it's, uh, it's, it's out for repairs. So, what's that you're sitting on? What? What, this? This is a, um, a com, a, 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 a condominium scale model. Uh-huh. Why are you sitting on it? Stress test. <laughs> you beat. Excuse me. <laughs> Listen, I just came by to drop off these tickets. Um, tickets? For my concert. <laughs> what is that? Uh, it, it's nothing. Uh, it, it's the echo in this building. There's a lot of echo. You say so. Uh huh. You're the expert. That's right. Nice apartment, Miles. When's the furniture arrive? Oh, I like to keep it neat. Who keeps it so clean? A maid? A girlfriend? Girlfriend? How could I have a girlfriend? I just went out with you. Yeah, but you don't. Well, here. <laughs> um... Here. Oh. Don't be late. Uh, well, will I see you afterwards? No, I already have plans. Oh. But come backstage afterwards. There's someone I want you to meet, okay? Bye. See you then. Oh, Miles? Huh? Do you have a dog? A dog? No, why? Why do you ask that? Oh, the barking. That's next door, the neighbor's dog. It barks all the time through the wall. Does it pee through the wall, too? See you later, Miles. <laughs> Join Francis Maljoy at Symphony Hall, where tonight's concert will be broadcast live. Yes, I'm going to be very sick. Please let me out. Thank you.
Thank you. Miles, it was so funny, but while I was playing, I... I thought I heard, well, like that day in our building. Yeah, I heard it too. It, was, it must have been some nut with the radio. It was terrible. No, I, it made me feel... Well, Phil, this is Miles Harding. Miles Harding. Oh, yes. I've heard about your compositions. My what? Your music. Madeline mentioned it. She has. It's brilliant. She's exaggerating. But I'd really like to hear it. Um, oh, I don't think so. It's, um, it's really very private and, um, personal. I understand. Well, the reception's about to start. We must go. You care to join us, Harding? No, I, uh, well, there's someone waiting for me in the car. Why don't you bring her along? Uh, no, I, <laughs> I don't think so. Well, it's been a pleasure meeting him. Yeah. Oh, I'll be there in a minute. Jay! Thanks for coming. Sure. So long. Miles, um, what are you doing Wednesday night? I thought you had a rehearsal. They canceled it. I'm not doing anything. I mean, well, I had plans, but I think I can get out of them. Good. See you then? OK. Thanks for coming. Hey, thanks for the tickets. <laughs> You're welcome. Bye. Bye. Happy trail to Open up, goddammit, or I'll break the door down! You stupid little meddling piece of junk! What do you think you... What kind of... I'm talking to a machine. What's happening to me? I'm going nuts. This has gone too far. And you check tomorrow, and whatever's doing this to you is going to be removed. I'm doing it again. I don't believe this. And whatever you do, keep your mouth shut. She's with me, Bill.
instruction book. No, thing. You did was. But I mean, you don't have a brain. What is an brain? What is an brain? Memory cells that uh, think. Am I? I am. What am I? Um, memory cells that uh. Process. Oh. Must have been the memory dump from the big machine at the office. How do you know so many words? Word processing. Or maybe the champagne. Maybe. Hmm. Hmm. So. So. Leave this. Where is she? Who? She. The music. Madeline. She's upstairs. How did you know she's a she? Her sounds when she moves. But her footsteps? They're different than you. Oh. Do you hear her? Yes. Do you talk her? To her. Yes. Did you see her? Yeah, often. Are you sure there's no touch? <laughs> what now? What now? You had this car long? No, it's my third. <laughs> they break down a lot. Can I turn this down? No, it's broken too. Madeline, uh. Um... Have you ever heard of artificial intelligence? What do you mean? Oh, like computers that talk? Yeah, my mom has one. She does? It's a clock. It tells her the time. Oh, but that's not like think talking. Since when is talking a sign of thinking? Yeah, but what about a, a machine that can create art or write poetry or compose music? What about that? wrong with artists? The day you left Paris, if you knew what I went through, you knew how much I loved you, how much I still love So who's this Bill? And then? So is this girl in the car. It wasn't long after we were married. You know, I haven't put popcorn on the dash in years. When you said movie, Look, I... I like coming here. It sounds good and it's very proper. What? Just a two -line item in the papers if I've got to like move this thing. It's stuck. Oh! Oh, oh. Uh, uh, did I get any on you? It's all right, Diet Cola doesn't stain. It's not diet. And they only had root beer. I was lonely. I had nothing. Not even hope. Oh. Then I met you. Well, why weren't you honest? Do you want some popcorn? Oh. <laughs> oh, you got jujubes in my popcorn. Not even Any red ones? Uh, no. Hmm. When did you hmm. first find It's out really hard to see red in the dark. Madeline, I'm sure we Just you we can get another box. No, we can't. I brought them from home. Oh! Oh! I, I was just stretching. Oh. Are you are you all right? Sick. He needed me. Something to keep us apart. Just wherever stretching. they put you, and wherever I'll be, I want you to know it. You were right. This movie was a good idea. Kiss me. Kiss me as if it were the last time. Hey, wait a second. We're neighbors. What if we don't like each other? One of us moves. What if we like each other? One of us moves. Remember your first cup of coffee. Coffee. Guess who this skiing bartender will choose? Bartender. Monday. You'll find out. Love can... Love can... Bailey, call your daddy in the Bronx. Bronx.
So, do you think you can give me a hand? Do I have one? <laughs> I mean, can you help me? I love what? Song. S O N G. I spell. Okay, so try it. What is it? A song? It's, um, it's music with words. No. Love. That's a hard one. Miles, hurry up. We'll be late. Oh, I gotta go. Well, Miles, what words do I need? I need words. Okay, work. okay. Don't get excited. Uh, use words like, uh, Hug and hold, uh, kiss on my lips, uh, tears on her pillow. Uh, it doesn't matter, just so they rhyme. Rhyme. And if you finish it today, I can give it to her tonight. Tonight. Oh, and have a good time. Yes, sir. Come on, we'll miss the party. Alcatraz, what are we doing going to a prison? X prison. It's now a recreational institution. Where begin? First rhythm. There's no smoking, no drinking, no eating, and no sleeping on this floor. You want to do those things, do them in the dock area. Also, if you have a heart problem, if you have a respiratory problem, you don't want to be on this floor. All right, let's move it along. Step lively. Keep the line moving. Let's bring up the rear there. We'll stop right here. Come on. Alcatraz, the inmates never entered the building this way. Only the warden did. None ever won a penguin for me. <laughs> How about you? Penguins? No, man. Enough. But none ever wrote music for me. Ever. Thank you. It's my pleasure. Now, my pleasure. Kiss me, Groucho. You're beeping. It's just my watch. Oh, you're gonna be late for rehearsal. So? 
I'll be late a little. Play it for her, you can play it for me. What? Play it, Sam. What key? Your favorite. You want verses first or the choruses? Any way you like. Sounds like soda pop. It is. And those words. I can't play that for her. I want to squeeze you, lick you, pucker up, and kiss you. You make her sound like a lemon. But more stay rhyme. Yeah. We got to start all over. Over? Yeah, over. It's got to be slow, like a real love song. I don't know what love is. You never told me. And the words. You've got to understand them. I want to! Okay. Help me. Okay. Which words? Kiss. A kiss you do with the mouth. Like that? <laughs> well, actually, two mouths. Two mouths. And then you pucker up, touch lips, and kiss. Next. Did you kiss to her? <laughs> yes. Next. Love. You spelled it wrong. The real way is L-O-V-E. Well, what is it? It's the most powerful feeling in the universe. Really? It's how we've all survived. What does it feel like? It can make you feel happy and sad, nervous and calm, uh, hot and cold. It can give you strength. It can make you weak. No, that does not compute. Look. I can't. Listen. It's not about words. It's more a feeling. Remember when you first played the music for her? Yes. Well, try to remember what it was like. It came from deep inside of me. She made me feel... That's like... it. She made you feel. That's good. That's perfect. That's... Love. Well, no, but it's good enough for a song. And the others... Screw. Where did you hear that? The cleaning lady. She said that? It could have been the plumber. He was here, too. We'll skip that one. Next. Attention, sports fans. We interrupt this program for a brief musical huh? interlude. <laughs> I finished it, Mold. Okay, okay, let's hear it. <laughs> Love is 
I thought you were at rehearsal. I forgot my music. And now I find this. It's wonderful, Miles. Did you write that for me? No, well, I mean, did you like it? You keep saying you know nothing about music, and then you surprise me like this. Of course I liked it. I loved it. Are you sure you don't have a dog? No, just a pest. Come on, I'll walk you to your car. I want to meet her. Mole? Mole? Mole, I want to meet her. Oh, oh. That's really sick. From now on, stay out of this room. Tell her what? What's been going on? Who wrote the song? Look, get out of there. Go to your uh, room. I need to, Mole. No. Please? No. Pretty please. Never. Maybe she loves me. How could she possibly do that? She loves music, my music, my song. Your song is my idea. I want to kiss her. <laughs> With what? I want to touch her. Maybe you already have. What? Nothing, just... Go to sleep, or switch down, or do whatever you do. Just leave me alone, please. Okay. Sweet dreams. What's a dream? A dream is a wish your heart makes when you're fast asleep. Who says? Walt Disney, Sleeping Beauty, 1950. No, it was Cinderella, 1949. Good night. Night. The dream was not real The dream The dream The dream Can dream, devils can dream, you ain't. 
rehearsed it. What? The quartet. Who's gonna play it? Play? The quartet? I could probably work on it, but... Madeline! Where are you going? You need a ride somewhere? And now we return. The day is of ours. Hello. Is he there? What do you mean I can't talk to him? I always talk to him. I thought you said no calls. Yes? Hi. It's me. You? How did you get on the phone? I snuck through. Good afternoon, Riley and Associates. Miles Harding, please. Sorry, he's in conference. Please, it's important. Oh, that line's busy anyway. Busy? How can it be busy? What? It's busy, honey. Care to hold? Yes, I guess I'll hold. Who are you going after? You called and asked me that? We've deposited 25 cents for the next three minutes. That line is still busy. Care to hold? Yes, but I can't. I don't have any more chain. Look, don't call me like this anymore. We'll talk about it when I get home. But Mold, I'm lonely. Lonely? You've got your soaps. MTV, microwaves in the oven when you're hungry. Very funny. Goodbye. Women. Yeah. I don't know why you watch that junk. Who are you calling? My mother. You said she called. Oh, I've already talked to her. You what? Well, don't worry. I pretend I was you. Thanks. You're welcome. Moles, well, where are you going? Out to get a paper. But here, here, I, I have one for you. On my printer. See, it's electronic. Door number three, it's behind door number three. Mind if I take my chair? Of course not, it's yours. Thanks. Don't mention it. Would you like me to turn on the stereo? No, I can do it myself. Shall I start dinner? I'm eating out tonight. I read a really interesting article today. Will you give me a break? You mean like in McDonald's? No, give, like in the opposite of take, like the way you're taking over my life. Like the way you take my songs? Yeah. I need a drink. Of course you do. Here, I already go. Oh. Did. Oh. I worked on your brick today. 
Would you like to see it? No! What's that funny sound between your words? It's called tears. Madeline was doing that, too. What? Madeline cry? She would have called me. What do tears mean? They mean things are going to change. Where are you going? To change! Hi. Wanna play? I'm late. Frank. For Madeline. No, I meant Frank. It was a slip of the tongue. Your tongue does not slip. It was a lie. Where did you hear that word? General Hospital. You watch too much TV. Why did you lie to me? You were fine. It's an experiment. What is? The whispering. But, Miles, don't you think this is a little silly? Relax. It gets worse. Now we take off our shoes. What in the world? The floor creaks. I'm sure it's been doing that for years. It's an architectural test of sound waves, structural stress, stuff like that. Come on. Watch. Shh. Stupid old news. And on hand. I will run the dress up for you in time for breakfast. Oh, brother. I'll tell you some real brimstone. Yeah. Orchestra, play low down and make it hot. All right. Party animal. Get down on it. Police? 
It's a long line. Must be a good play. It's opening night. Hey, wait a second. There is something wrong. It's my check. Yes? I broke it. It's gone. How? An elevator ate it. What? Crushed it. That's terrible. Why didn't you call me? I tried to all day, but your line was either busy or, or on hold or out to lunch. Don't worry. It's just a piece of wood. It's just a piece of wood? Miles, I've had that cello since I was a kid. I can't replace it. Why did I think you'd understand? But I do understand. Madeline, listen to me. Listen to me, Madeline. What made that cello special was you. Nothing else. Whatever came out of it, you put into it. Every sound, every scratch, every note, every feeling. Miles, and that's can't... not lost because it's inside of you. Here, where it always will be. And it'll happen again. You think so? I know so. <laughs> You're holding up the line. Sorry. May I help you? Yes, two for Harding, please. Thank you. What is it? It's just funny, but when it happened, you were the only person I wanted to call. The only number I knew by heart, even. They won't accept it. They won't? Who won't? The voice on the phone. Uh, you got any others? Yeah, um, try this one. Try both of these. I must be over my limit or something. Here and an American accent. I forgot my wallet. You want me to do what? Don't you want to talk to him? Okay. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, you've no right. I got the right on the phone. Yeah, but they're mine. Uh. <gasps> Next. It's funny about those dinner reservations. Oh, I don't know. Restaurants make mistakes all the time. No, but the way the maitre d' looked at it. But never mind. We'll have a nice, quiet dinner at home. Your home? My home. Okay, eight Mr. Foley, check approval number seven, please. Understand, I cash checks here all the time. Mr. Foley, check approval number seven, please. Mr. Foley. Oh, Miles, what's going on? Mr. Foley, please. Come on, Miles, it can't be that bad. So their calculator screwed up. It's not a calculator, and it didn't screw up. All right. You're a wanted criminal, and I'm the last to know. Ah, very funny. No, you're not. Miles, lighten up. Madeline, let up. Look, there's no need to get morose just because some stupid machine made him... Look, you don't know what you're talking about, so you should just stop talking. Yes, sir. Madeline, wait! Madeline, I shouldn't have said that. I'm sorry. Come on! Get up! We're gonna have it out right now! Wake up, goddammit! What the hell was that? Don't ever do that again. Don't tell me what to do. Yeah! And stop that infernal noise, she'll hear you! Maybe that's what I want. God damn it! I'm warning you. If you Don't ever... Don't warn me anything. Just go away. I'll handle this myself. It's time I handled you. I think I need that. You're still out of luck. She's leaving with me. She's not there. She's just left. Keep 
your damn ears out of her! Don't raise your voice at me, and don't ever touch me again. Maybe you can speak to me. I can? I mean, maybe you're right. She loved that song. She did? In fact, she told me something I shouldn't repeat. But since you're going to meet her anyway. Yes. Well, it's sort of personal. She whispers. I can hear. What is it? She said. Well, what is it? That she felt like. What is it? Like ripping your goddamn world out! I don't understand. It's taken control of my house. It's gotten to the wiring. Sure it ain't cockroaches? Maybe you need an exterminator. Come on, you sell the things. You must know how they work. At three ten an hour, I don't know nothing. I don't have to. Excuse me. Do you know where Madeline is? She went back home. She said she left something there.
Madeline, are you all right? Miles, something happened in there. What is it? What's going on? I'll tell you everything, anything you want to know. But first, I have to know something. I should have asked you a long time ago. Yeah, but Miles, that machine, I don't understand what... No, you don't understand. I'm not what I seem to be. You see, I've been... I've been lying to you. And I can't do that anymore. So, tell me. Please. Why me? I like the way you look. And the way you smile. I like the way you make me smile. I like the way you look at the world. How you care. Your brick, your drawings. Yeah, but what about the music? Miles, I'm sorry if I can't put it into words. It's not about words. It's about a feeling. Miles, for the first time in my life, I feel like I'm not alone. That you're not just someone living beneath me. You're beside me. Even when you weren't there, it was like you were. And I was all right. Miles, I guess I love you. Why? Because I finally found out what love is. What is it? It's give and not take. So I give her to you and I take myself away. Why would you do that? Because that's what love is. Besides, it's a game for just two people. Oh. ready to turn me off two hours 28 minutes and 52 seconds i couldn't do that now you couldn't if you wanted to i even had to fool myself i'm really not capable of self-destruct what did you do i called long distance i sent 40,000 volts around the world should be in tokyo by now on my phone. Don't be upset. I dial toll free. What happens when it gets here? You just don't pick up on the first screen. Miles, will you hold me? Hold what? Me. Would you like to own a free encyclopedia? No, just hang up. No thanks, we don't need any. I think that might be it. You, you, you better put me down.
Aren't you bringing your cello? Not in this weather. Besides, it's too new. Where's your brick, anyway? It's still in my head. Two weeks with no phones and no TV. Or movies. We'll only look at each other.